nice cock, bro. Oh, hey. Welcome back. Another exciting episode of cooking in Chef Colton's kitchen. Today we will be making cornbread. The time is 12.09 o'clock. Yeah, so let's do this. Um, what are we making? Cornbread. Preheat your oven to 400 degrees, which is hot. Hope everyone doing good out there today, you know? Just found out the girl I hooked up with on Halloween is still dressed like a dude, so like, that's kind of crazy. <sighs> you know, I used to wonder how people like made, um, you want a cup of flour? I used to wonder how people made recipes, because like, I'm guessing it was just like they threw random shit in a bowl until it worked. And like, I've been home for like a few days and like, I get it now. I get how long it is. So much food in time. <laughs> Next, you want one cup of corn. Okay, so this cornmeal, I spilled like this entire jar in a Walmart on the floor and then just kind of walked away and got a new one. So, sorry if you had to clean that up. I tried to do one of those Disney sing-alongs with my dad, but um, turns out that both of you need to um, know the songs and know what's happening for that to work, so that didn't work. I used to play, play, um, used to play baseball as a child, and my dad told me some great advice, he yelled, you suck, and he was right, <laughs> bravest man I ever knew, no one else was that brave to tell me, next you want two thirds of a cup of sugar. Two, two thirds. Where the fuck is my two thirds thing? One third. I guess I can just use that. Does two, cause one third and one third is two third. Yes, sir. What? Oh, sugar. You know, some people are saying that like, kids are calling. <laughs> Calling coronavirus boo boomer remover, and like I really want to hang out with those kids. They seem they seem really cool. You know, yeah, wish I was that. Okay. I picked pink bowl because it's my favorite. Um, that was kind of key. Um, next you want a teaspoon of salt. Nope. Not sure why no one actually likes salt. Um, next you want three and a half teaspoons of baking powder. I like baking soda better. If you put baking soda in instead of baking powder, it 
kind of tastes like butthole. So, baking powder it is. <laughs> so, one of my friends um, has to take online classes, and one kid literally just put up the picture of that guy pretending to be a lamp. And if you know what I'm talking about, props to you. And if you don't, props to you. You want one third of a butt stick of butter, but you want to microwave it for 30 seconds in a bowl. Because last time I tried it not in a bowl, it didn't end up good. Ever realize how whenever you have an argument, they always bring it to the absolute fucking extreme, and it's so stupid? You're like, we're lost, but like, you're not really lost, you're like five minutes away from your house. And you're like, it's fine, like, we'll just take this road. And they're like, what if there was a serial killer after us? And it's like, seriously? Seriously, Jill? Jillian? Does, does it? Does it look like there's, there's a murderer behind us? No? Does, does Bob, the 45-year-old man behind us, walking his dog that is literally 10 years old and can barely breathe, do you think he's had a knife to come stab us? I don't fucking think so. <gasps> Bitch. Holy shit, I have to stop doing this so long. <clears throat> Um, so maybe not 30 seconds, maybe more like 10. I feel like I remember that, but I'm truly a remarkable human being. You need an egg, Max. So I was thinking about this earlier. If you were to crack someone's skull between your legs, would they die? Well, I mean, first of all, you'd be... have fucking huge legs. But, like, would, would the person die? I feel like they could survive, personally. You know? Personally. I was in the bathroom at my work, and... You want one cup of milk? And I looked some guy in the eye. Well, I almost looked some guy in the eye. We weren't friends, so I didn't want him to think I was serious because I wanted him to go, I can't believe we actually have to fucking wash our hands now. But I felt like, you know, he might not have taken it as a joke. And that would be bad. You know, that would be bad. Okay, so did I watch a 20 minute video on, on all of Dr. Doom and Spurge's backstories? First of all, RIP my boy Balloony. Second of all, maybe. But Phineas and Fred was such a fire show. Okay. supposed to put this in a round pan but <clears throat> I don't have that by the way a circle is a number a letter and a shape so I'm gonna go with the closest thing to a circle the second closest thing to a circle a square a triangle is technically the second closest thing because it would have like three and a circle of zero edges I think. Well, I, I know a circle of zero edges. I think it'd be the closest thing. I don't know. Maybe one of those like weird heptagon thingies would be closer. Maybe the triangle is the furthest away. Shit. 
I never thought about that. Uh. How's everyone's week going? Worked a shit ton last week. Was not enjoyable. Watched my boss tell someone to fuck off. Was very enjoyable. She also texted me. Didn't respond till the next day because I don't check my text. Don't you call me out on it. To which I said I didn't check my text. So that's going to be a fun conversation tomorrow. <sighs> Always good to have something to look forward to. You could put like honey on this or the cornbread or like butter. Once it's cooked, obviously. There's this bomb barbecue place next town over. And like, oh, dude, I go there and like I eat an entire bait cow. Just how that shit. Just like. <laughs> I Tail, tail and everything. You know how hard it is to get a cow's tail? I've never, I don't even think they sell cow's tails. And yet, I eat it. Sometimes they just deep fry the cow and like give it to me. I had Popeyes for the first time today. Dude, they're fucking good. I also ate a biscuit without water and was like dry heaving I was like <laughs> so like that that's always good uh, I think this is ready ew that was like way too much ah. So my mom already yelled at my whole family, so I don't know how the rest of this family time is going to go. I low-key think this pan was like the perfect size. You know those like glass Tupperwares? When, I might have low-key done this on the show, but I don't think I did. But like I put one of those in the oven because I was like, oh, it's glass, it will be fine. And like almost broke it in the oven. <laughs> this was like definitely like a slightly too big pan, but like here we are. You get the best of both worlds. Light up the chill. Light up the chill. Also, there was an active shooter right next to my work the other day. And can you believe he had the audacity to not stop in and shoot me? Fucking bullshit. Look at how nice this looks, though. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I would eat that. Oof, or some ice cream. Oof. Ice cream. Yes. Oh, I got a haircut. If you couldn't tell. So, now that your oven is preheated, you want to put it in for approximately 20 to 25 minutes. Also for the calzone episode, I'm not sure why, but for some reason you only had to cook them like at half the time that I said, but the video accidentally cut out before I could say that, so yeah. Um, so, um, Charlie Demuriel, like TikTok girl, got the, go on, got to go on Jimmy Kimmel, and I would love to go. Absolutely, or was it Jimmy Fallon? I don't know. She got to go on a late night talk show. I would, I would go on a midday talk show. I know those probably get less views, but like, 
I'd sit down with Oprah, Ellen, The Five, Jimmy Kimmel, Jimmy Goffin, Jimmy Fallon, that that one on Comedy Central that just makes fun of people. He's funny. What has the glasses? Wears a suit. Saturday Night Live. Like, him. I, I would go. I would. I'd even do the fake car karaoke. You could hear me singing. Like, how I was next to my dad earlier when he was looking at me and saying fun things like, you're adopted and you're the least favorite and you're not even mentioned in our will. I would be there. So. Bullshit, I'm not. Um. Hmm. So. For some reason, the YouTube app, fun fact, I should have probably stopped shooting on YouTube, so I'm just gonna get this out of the way, like, wicked fast. So, like, when you're uploading a video, it uploads, and then, like, it loads, it waits, and then it prepares it to 100%, and then it uploads it to 100%, and then it, like, I don't know, there's, like, a third loading screen, and, like, for some reason, that loading screen, it just goes zero to, like, 100. It doesn't, like, progress. So you think your phone's fucking broken for, like, 30 minutes, and then finally it loads. You can't, like, have your phone shut off during this or you exit the app, which is fucking bullshit. And the fucking bullshit that there's three screens you have to go to. Like, my God. Like, it, it literally takes equally as long to film a video as to post it. And I probably shouldn't be shitting on YouTube this deeply because that's the app I'm on. But, like, eh. What are they gonna do? Take away my ad revenue? Please don't. That's it's the only way I feed my kids. We use flour bags and rice bags as clothes. We we only eat the one meal I make a week on the show. I need that ad revenue. Oh, another fun fact about YouTube. They have to cut the video at 28 minutes. Apparently. So, more of that story is this is gonna take 18 more minutes and tw 18 plus 17 is more than 28. So, yeah. I have an absurd amount of bananas in my house, and my family demanded I make something with bananas. And I didn't. I wonder if I have corn on the cob. There is no visible corn on the cob that I can see. So. Mm. Uh, what What is cornmeal? Is it just ground up corn? Do you know Americans eat so much corn that it's actually find traces of it in our DNA? Fun fact with Colton. I'm not as dumb as I look. Or else I couldn't form sentences. And I can obviously form sentences some of the time. Oh, ingredients. Wait, where? I think I just... Oh, ingredients. Degerminated yellow cornmeal. The the first ingredient is cornmeal is cornmeal. That seems like a conspiracy. I'm no expert. But that seems like a conspiracy. Oh wait, you're watching me. Maybe they're watching you, watching us, watching you, watching me, watching me. Yes. You know I've never actually seen an episode of this. <laughs> so like, quick shout out if you watch them. But since you have nothing better to do, might as well watch them. Might as well make them. I mean, I might as well make them. Don't steal my thunder. Mm. So, 20 minutes seems like a good time to cut this off. So, I hope everyone is doing truly stay fantastic. Wash your hands, stay safe. Show social distance. As you notice, I'm alone because I have no friends. And... 
have a nice week. Can't wait to tune in with you soon. Hope you're all doing well. Love you. Bye.